We present a theory and a set of tools for shape space exploration of a class of discrete developable surfaces, known as discrete orthogonal geodesic nets, or DOGs. Dog nets are a quad mesh analog of developable surfaces defined by simple local angle constraints. All angles around a vertex are equal. Our main theoretical contribution is the characterization of discrete surfaces that satisfy these constraints, or its shape space. We show that the space is locally a manifold of a fixed dimension, apart from a set of singularities. This proves the existence of a rich set of continuous deformations or flows on these discrete objects, including non-isometric stretching deformations. These can be defined by endowing the space with a metric and specifying an objective function. We use our theory to discretize these flows and to devise a strategy to handle singular points in the shape space. We further derive a symmetric semi-positive definite dog Laplacian operator and a mean curvature by deriving the gradient of the surface area of a dog net. These two are shown to converge on a sampling of a smooth net, also when sampling along the infamous smooth Schwarz lantern. We use the Laplacian and the mean curvature as a basis for the shape space metric and the flow objective functions. Our mean curvature flow can be used for smoothing jaggy, discrete orthogonal geodesic nets while staying in the shape space of dogs. To the right, we see how the surface Gauss map changes under smoothing. We further show how to implement a subdivision operator as a combination of Catmull Clark and our dog smoothing flow. Our tools can be directly plugged into a developable surface editing system. The user is able to model a wide range of bending, stretching and tangential deformations. Unlike previous work, heavily stretching a surface results in a smooth animation and a uniform grid. We also extend the shape space of dogs to support sharp creases and curved folds, allowing tangent discontinuities along arbitrary curves on the surface. Lastly, we show how to compute flows induced by constraining whole curves on a surface using positional constraints. We first represent a curve intrinsically as a set of points on edges, and then we choose the target curve positions and compute an interpolation between the curve's initial and target state. Finally, we feed the positions of the curve as soft positional constraints to our flow algorithm, optimizing bending and grid regularity while interpolating the constraints. Thank you for watching.